Vitamin E, you know, it's a magical supplement for many health conditions. Hi, I'm Dr. James Machino. You know, vitamin E supplementation has been popular for a very long time, and rightly so because it does so many things to help support human health. Let me just touch base with you on some of the supplementation studies that we have that shows its clinical applications. With respect to heart disease or cardiovascular disease, there's evidence that vitamin E decreases the damage to cholesterol in the bloodstream, making it less likely to stick to the walls of the artery. It also inhibits excess clotting of platelets so you don't form abnormal clots, which can be the final plug that actually leads to a heart, att a heart attack or an ischemic stroke. And it has other effects, we think, on reducing the likelihood of heart disease getting started, antioxidant effects and, and others. Vitamin E has also been shown to slow down the progression of Alzheimer's disease when it's used at the right dose, even in conjunction with Alzheimer's drugs. For people that have already had cancer, it, it, certain types of vitamin E, like vitamin E succinate, seem to play a really important role as, as part of the adjunctive nutritional management of cancer. And there's some studies, like the EPIC study, that show if you take certain antioxidants like vitamin E at high, high enough doses, it may help to reduce your risk of cancer by up to 48%. And then we've seen it be very effective in women that have fibrocystic breast disease. We've seen that it can slow down the progression of cataracts and macular degeneration, two very common eye diseases, and maybe help to prevent those things. You know, in, one st in terms of male fertility, in one study where you had males who were sort of diagnosed with, who were inf infertile, if you will, they, they couldn't impregnate their spouses, they had gone through testing. Of, of the 52 subjects who were given vitamin E supplementation at a specific dose, 11 of them were able to impregnate their, their spouse, you know, within a one-year period. So vitamin E seems to have an effect on sperm quality, sperm production, sperm motility uh, for uh, couples who are trying to get pregnant. It's also been shown to help people that have immune compromised states where they have sort of immune damaged diseases, helps to support immune system function. It's been useful in patients with hepatitis C improving liver function. It helps in people that have, with have, who have asthma. It's useful for people that have rheumatoid arthritis or osteoarthritis decreasing the inflammatory response. It's been shown to be important for diabetics to improve glucose sensitivity. People who exercise regularly it decreases the amount of oxidative free radical damage to their tissues. All of these things have been shown in clinical studies. It helps women that have premenstrual syndrome, individuals with Parkinson's disease helping to slow down the progression of the disease, even some cases of restless leg syndrome. So vitamin E plays an important role in the prevention and management of many health conditions. So what I'd like you to do is click on the link where you can read my review article on vitamin E and you'll see all the scientific references there. But it'll help you understand which dosages make sense for you based on your state of health or if you have any health conditions, you know what dosage vit of, of vitamin E to use. You'll also see the drug nutrient interactions that are important for vitamin E so that you don't do something that might be inappropriate or dangerous for yourself. Now remember that at machinohealth.com, You'll see all of my other research review papers. You'll see footage from my live professional seminars. You'll see other downloads and videos and resources I've created. They're all there to help you lead a long, healthy, functional life. My research review papers and teaching materials are complete with all the scientific references. So you'll see you're getting only evidence-based information from me on any health topic that you're looking for. So you should make MachinoHealth.com an ongoing, reliable resource of health and wellness information for both you and your family. Thanks so much for watching.